Sexual violence is not about sex, right? It's about power, and it's about the abuse of power. When I think about the, the things that Hillary Clinton say about um, the Monica Lewinsky and Bill Clinton affair not being an abuse of power, that is just tragic and it's wrong. The affair and what happened was consensual, and I recognize that, I think we all recognize that. Monica herself has said, you know, this was consensual, but it certainly is an abuse of power. You're talking about an age dynamic, but you're also talking about the President of the United States. The amount of power, the amount of accumulated power that is in that position alone versus an intern, it's absolutely an abuse of power. It's unfortunate that it wasn't used as a moment to be accountable. We need to see what different models of accountability look like. I think now, 20 years down the road, it's okay to say this was an abuse of power. It doesn't mean that he had to step down from his position, but it, 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 is, um, it was an abuse of power that I'm sure he regrets. There's nothing wrong with saying that, right? It's done, he can't be impeached in this moment. It would be wonderful to see examples of accountability in that way because it's really about harm reduction. What that does is reduce some of the harm that Monica experienced in that, ex in that whole exchange, right? Because she was the kid. And so her life permanently is altered. She has to deal with all of those things, but two people made a choice and one of those people was the most powerful man in the world. And that's just, I just think it's unfortunate.